What's up everybody, it's your boy Richard, you know who the hell it is, and today as you guys can see, we're going to be reacting to the new SMR movie called Cody's Stolen Penny, and also yes guys, another thing if you guys did not notice this, we finally got the old computer back, we managed to get it fixed, the reason why, um, the reason why it wasn't working is because there was a lot of dust in the in the computer. There was a lot of dust in the computer and the dust was just destroying the computer's inside insides. So, yeah, so mom brought it to a, a repair shop and yeah, they got all of the dust out of, out of the computer. So now we finally have the computer working and this means that we can use this computer to react to SML videos. All right. Anyways, Cody stolen penny. Let's get this thing started. And three, two, one, clickly clack. We are SMO back. I don't know why. I don't know why I say it. I just really like saying it. Well, actually, I'm also also by the way. Um, I literally just stole that from Logan because when Logan reacts to his SMO videos, he says that clickly clack thing. But honestly, I don't really care if I steal it. I I like saying it. Oh, look at the Kiki. Uh, hey, Junior. Oh, hey, Cody. The cat looks like he's not enjoying it. Well, who's that? Oh, it's my cat. Oh, well, what's his name? Oh, it's Blue Eyes White Kiki. <laughs> Blue Eyes White Kiki. <laughs> you know, like Blue Eyes White Dragon from Yu-Gi-Oh? Yeah, I know. The Kiki. Oh, that's pretty cool. Blue Look Eyes at my Kiki. Coin collection. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah, check this out. Man, that's a lot of coin. I got all these pennies. Oh, but this one's my favorite one. See, that's a 1943 steel penny. Now I know what you're thinking. Cody, aren't pennies made of copper? Well, Junior, normally you'd be right. But you see, in 1943, that's when World War II was happening, and they needed the copper for war materials. So they stopped producing copper pennies and made them out of steel instead. So if you... Oh, so they made coins out of steel. I thought they were made out of... Copper penny. I thought they were made out of metal. Well, they are made out of metal, but... From 1943, it's I, really valuable. I mean, was... coins are made out of metal, but maybe back then they used to be made out of steel, but now they're made out of metal. Minted by mistake, but this one, this one's made of steel, so it's not that valuable, but it's a piece of history, so to me, it's priceless. Oh, that's really cool, Cody. Hold on, I'll show you another one. Oh, there's a lot of fur on my couch. Let me get my lint roller. Yeah, <laughs> get that fur out of here. That's really cool. Bro oh, you're gonna love this. Oh my god, br bro. Bro, just, bro, bro, couldn't, couldn't you just remove the freaking coin? Couldn't you just take the coin out of the couch? Couldn't you just take the coin, put it on the table or floor, and you could have just got rid of the fur, but you just got rid of the fur, fur and the coin. Okay, check this one out, Junior. It's from 1919. Wait, Junior. What happened to my penny? I don't know. It's right here. I, I don't know what happened to it. Well, it's gone now. It got sucked in into this it, thing. You were, I was lit rolling the couch, and you were looking at your penny. I didn't take it. Well, you, well, Junior rent, rent, rent rolled. Junior rent rolled the freaking coin, the freaking penny. He, he was going to rent roll the freaking fur off the couch. But not only that, he also rent rolled the freaking penny. Well, I didn't just get up and walk away. Junior pennies don't have legs. I, don't I know, know that, that dumbass. So you just made it disappear like you're David Copperfield, or more like David Pennyfield, or, or David David Steelfield, because because it's made of steel and not copper, like like pennies normally are. And you made it disappear, and David Copperfield makes things disappear because he's a he's a magician. I didn't touch your stupid penny, Cody. I don't care about your dumb pennies or your penny collection. No, Junior, I'm so mad. But I gotta go say something real quick. The internet browser you're using sucks. Want to know why? I, because it doesn't have custom SML mods. It's time to fix that with Opera GX. Once you download Opera GX, it's super... All right, this is another sponsor. We know we know what we do when we come across with sponsors. You guys know what we do when we come across sponsors. We freaking skip them because we don't give a damn about these darn sponsors. Don't give a damn about these damn sponsors, so skip to the next scene. Ugh, Junior, ugh, that ad read temporarily distracted me, but now that I'm back and I'm seeing you, I am so mad, I can't believe you would steal my steel penny like that. I did not steal Bruh, it. Bruh, he didn't penny. steal it, no, he rent rolled the, the freaking penny. Else, unless it was your Bro, 
Junior did not take the penny. He rent rolled the freaking penny with the fur. I don't. I didn't. I don't know why Junior could have just took the penny and just put it on the floor or on the ground, but he didn't do that. He just decided to freaking rent roll the freaking couch with the fur and the freaking penny. Stupid cat. Actually, I shouldn't call him stupid. He seemed very nice and he was very fluffy, so I shouldn't say that. But I bet he didn't take my. Yeah, you better not call he blue eyes white he doesn't Kiki. Care. He doesn't know the difference stupid. between steel and copper. He doesn't know about World War Two. He doesn't know history, Junior. He doesn't care. He's a cat. He did not steal your penny, Cody. No one stole it. It's just lost. Oh yeah. Well, it was a steel penny, so that's why I think you wanted to steal my steel penny. I did not want to steal your steel penny, Cody. No one cares about your stupid penny. Only you care about pennies. Oh, Junior, this really salts my apples. Oh boy. Oh, you are a you are a big jerk. Just a big jerk face. You don't Bro, it's just a you penny. Get over You're it. You're the biggest jerk face I've ever seen. Take it back. Nope, you are a bad guy. You are not a good person. Oh, you are You are rooting for a booting. You are clamoring. Man, for a bro, why are you getting mad over... Bro, Cody, how are you... Bro, why are you getting so mad over one penny, bro? Look at all them coins you have. You're really getting mad at one penny? Bro, you literally have a whole collection of pennies, bro. Hammering, hammering, mister. You are bro, it's just one penny gone. Get over it. You have, like, so many store, pennies in your freaking penny cart. collection. I would, I would take a shopping cart, but not not somebody else's shopping cart. I wouldn't want to damage anybody else's produce. No, it would be my shopping cart. Probably not in the parking lot because I, I wouldn't want it to roll away and hit somebody's car and cause property damage. I would... That'd be bad. I, I don't want that. But, but no, I, I'd kick it just so it made the sound, you know? But... But not too hard though, because I, I don't want to damage the shopping cart because then the yeah we know responsible. I don't yeah you said it I, I just kick it right into the shopping cart return but but probably probably I wouldn't do that either because then it might roll away and then the shopping cart boy would have to chase after it and he doesn't get paid enough for that kind of an inconvenience so I, I wouldn't kick the shopping cart at all but I am so mad Junior you are munching for a punching hey Junior are you ready to go to the movies oh wow oh god damn it we have Penelope in here oh, oh so you're gonna spend my her. stolen penny on a movie ticket. Cody, a movie ticket costs more than a penny. Yeah, like, bro, how can I buy a movie ticket, bro? A movie tickets, bro, movie tickets are worth, they're, they cost way, they cost, bro, movie tickets cost a lot, bro. One penny can't buy myself one t movie ticket, bro. Movie tickets are expensive as hell. Movie tickets are like six dollars, or they can be even nine dollars. Who knows? They can even be twelve dollars for one goddamn movie ticket, bro. I can't. I can't even buy. I bro, bro. I'm. I can't even buy myself, bro. Even with a penny, I can't even buy myself a gumball from a gumball machine. Can't even buy a gumball from a gumball machine with a penny, bro. Can't do it. I can't buy a goddamn gumball. From a gumbo machine with a penny because people don't use pennies anymore. Junior, I'll have you know that steel penny is worth thirteen to thirty cents depending on the condition. Pennies are technically useless. They're like they don't. They're not worth anything, bro. They 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 don't buy you anything. You can't buy them. You can't. We. I'm pretty. Well, you can buy them, but well, it's from people. You can't buy them from shops. I don't know, but. Pennies can't buy you anything. They can't buy you anything. And it wasn't They're useless. Good condition, so People don't even use cents. them. Anymore. And why is there another cat in here, Junior? Are you spending my penny on cats? You need more cats? Wait. Bro, pennies, bro. Pe bro, like what I said, bro. Pennies cannot buy you anything. Cody, you had a steel penny? I had a steel penny until somebody decided to get sticky fingers. Junior, you stole Cody's steel penny? I did not steal his stupid penny. I don't know what happened to it. Oh, he stole it, Penelope, because it was right there. I'm talking right there. I mean, literally right there and i looked down for one second and then i look back up and poof it's gone just like poof i did not take his stupid penny penelope he doesn't know what he's talking about he just lost his own penny and he wants to blame someone for it junior it's not funny give it back to him i did not take his stupid penny let's just go to the dumb movies what movie are you guys in kung fu panda 4 oh wow oh kung fu panda kung fu panda especially the fourth bro combo panda Com kung fu panda 4 Oh, I thought it was just Kung Fu. As soon as Penelope said Kung Fu Panda, I thought it was like the first one. Well, actually, Kung Fu Panda first. The first Kung Fu Panda is not even in theaters anymore. But I thought. 
I thought as soon as Penelope said Kung Fu Panda, <laughs> bro, oh my god, Kung Fu Panda, shit, I'll go watch it in the theaters. But when she said the fourth, the like the fourth one, oh fuck yeah, I gotta watch that in the theaters, especially with popcorn and Coke and soda. Oh, okay, Kung Fu Panda sounds really fun. Well, why don't you just come with us? No, no, I don't have enough money because I'm 13 to 30 cents short because somebody stuck my penny. Cody, I'll get your ticket. Well, thank you. Thank you very much, Penelope C. Jr. That's what a real friend looks like. I would not steal your stupid penny because I don't care about your dumb penny. How about you guys just go to the movies because I haven't even seen the first three Kung Fu Pandas. Oh, wow. Wow, wow. How dare you, bro? How dare you, bro? How in the world... Have you not seen Kung Fu Panda 1, Kung Fu Panda 2, and Kung Fu Panda 3, bro? They've been out, like, they've, they've been out through years. Like, Kung Fu Panda 3 has been out, like, it came out in 2016. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it came out in 2016, Kung Fu Panda 3. How? How, how did you never, how haven't you seen Kung Fu Panda? The third, the second, and the first, bro. Well, let me tell you something right now, Junior. If you don't watch Kung Fu Panda, then I don't know what to say to you, bro. I, I, we can't be friends, bro. No, he's a thief. He hasn't even seen the first three. Well, I don't like karate movies. Well, it's not karate, Junior. It's Kung Fu. It's a yeah, it's more than dark. karate, Everybody bro. Everybody loves Kung Fu fighting. Okay, well, listen. I'll look, I'll just go see the fourth one. I don't have to see the first three. You can't start with the fourth one. You gotta see. The nah. And you gotta see the first one, bro. Because if you see the fourth one, it doesn't make sense. Because, because you won't. Because, what if like some of the characters in the movie say like, say something from the maybe like what if some characters in Kung Fu Panda Four they might say something like that was from like Kung Fu Panda Two and Kung Fu Panda Three. You won't know what the hell they're talking about because you haven't seen Kung Fu Panda 1 or 3 or 2nd or the second one. There's three! The Star Wars movies are out of order! You start with the fourth one with the Star Wars. But it, it's not like that with Kung Fu Panda. Listen, yeah. it doesn't matter. Let's go see this stupid dumb movie. Well, I'm coming too. You're, you're not getting out of this that easy. Sorry, excuse me, sorry, sorry. Hey, Junior, I can't help but notice you bought the large popcorn. That'll run you about $12.50. That's a lot of money to spend on popcorn. It's almost like you came into a lot of money lately. Cody, you said your stupid penny was worth 30 cents. This popcorn was $12.50. How would I buy- Yeah, how would he even buy that, bro? With one stupid penny, bro? I popcorn with your penny. I don't know, Junior. I don't know how many steel pennies you've been stealing from around town since you're so good at making them disappear. Shh! The movie's starting! Hiya! Hiya! Skadoosh! I'm Jack Black as a panda! Hi! Jack Black! Shh! Oh, I really would love to see all this kung fu happening on the screen, but I just can't take my eyes off of Junior because I can't trust him for a second! Kung fu? How about panda fu? Hiya! Wait, no, wait, I got Junior. I got some gummy bears. Try not to take any. Oh, but you won't want them because they're not made of steel. Because if they made them out of steel, that would be a choking hazard. Bro, shut up, bro! I'm not gonna steal your damn gold bears, bro! I don't want none of your stupid things, bro. I don't want your stupid gold bears. I don't want your stupid pennies. I don't even care if you have $100 bills, bro. I don't care, bro. I don't care, bro. I I'm not going to steal that. it, bro. Guys, I'm trying to watch the movie. Why would I steal oh, yeah. something from my friend? Oh, yeah. Well, from my gay I friend. Those. I don't want any of them. Well, actually, I don't even know if I want them because they might taste like whoever's out of yours, but... Actually, you know what? Wait, 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 bro. Hold on. Yeah, I don't even know if I want them because they might taste like whoever sat here's butt. Bro, aren't you gay? Don't you like eating butt? Don't you like taking balls in the face, bro? Might as well get to eating them. Get this one out of the way. Oh, I dropped one on the ground, Cody. Oh, you're so embarrassing! I can't believe you stole my gummy bear, too, Junior. I didn't steal your stupid gummy bear. It fell on the floor. And I can't believe you guys got us kicked out of the movie theater. That was so embarrassing. Well, this could all be resolved if Junior would just put his hand in his pocket and pull out my steel penny. I don't have anything in my pocket because I don't have pockets. Okay, well, your shoe, then. I don't have your penny in my shoe. I didn't steal your stupid penny, Cody. Yeah, well, I already called the police. But you called the police? Yep, that's how serious. You called the police? Bro, you called... You 
called the police all because I stole one penny, bro? Because this is their other way over here right now. Oh, please tell me it's not my dad. Hey, there, somebody call the cops? Yeah, I It's your dad. I did. Oh, hey, Penelope. Hi, Dad. Did you do your homework? Yes, Dad. Are you sure? Dad! You know, Penelope, whenever I ask the guys in death row if they did their homework when they were a kid, they say, yeah, I killed them and I kill them again, too. I don't really like to talk to them. Wow, Dad, that's a great story. Thanks. Well, I would like to report a robbery. Oh, a robbery, huh? Did he have a gun? I don't know. I never thought he would steal from me, so who knows what else he's capable of. Okay, well, what did he steal? Bro, I'm your I'm friend. Why would I have any weapons, pennies. bro? You see, during World War II, they didn't make pennies with copper. Yeah, no, I, I know the story about the pennies. So was it a copper penny or a steel penny? Because if it was a copper penny, that would be worth over a million dollars, and that would be a very serious crime. No, no it, was it was made out of steel. Oh, okay, well. That's not that big of a deal. I mean, they're only worth a few cents. I mean, anything yeah, like, bro, if the penny was made out of copper, bro, yeah, I could buy a lot of things. I could buy a lot of things with copper pennies, but it was made out of steel, so it's not worth technically anything. Can't even buy myself a gumbo from theft. a gumbo Oh, machine. it was petty, all right. Well, he stole it, and I want him in handcuffs. Okay, well, let me conduct my police interrogation. Hey, you steal his penny? No. Oh, okay. Well, is there anybody else who could have seen this happen? Well, his cat? Well, I guess we could ask the cat. Okay, I'll bro, go it's ask a cat, him. bro. Hey, cat, you steal my penny? Huh? What? Don't <laughs> bro, blue, eye, blue eyes white, blue eyes white Kiki does not want to talk to Cody. Run away from me. Hey. Did you talk to the cat? Yeah, but he ran away from me. But that's okay. He seemed pretty innocent to me. And besides, I think I already know who the thief is. I think he's in this room. I just wish he would own up to it. I didn't steal your penny, Cody. Oh, really, Junior? That's very Why interesting. Why would I you even want to try to steal a penny, bro? It's you. not even worth anything. I was just anything. talking to the thief, so it's really interesting you're the first one to answer. Well, I thought you were talking to me because you've been accusing me all day of stealing it. Or maybe you just felt guilty for stealing my penny. I don't feel guilty. Oh, okay. See, he feels no remorse, so he's also a narcissist as well as a thief. Cody, are you sure it didn't fall on, like, the couch cushions or something? No, it didn't. Junior stole it. Well, did you check the couch cushions? No, and I will not do that. Okay. Okay, well, what if you accidentally put it back in the coin bin without realizing it? I would have no, it got that. Cody. Come on. No, the freaking penny got sucked up by that thing. The freaking couch stealer, whatever the fuck it's called. I forgot what I it was called coins. again. Maybe it somehow this got back thing. In there. We just the penny got sucked in into this thing. Notice, or maybe you put it in the coin bin. I, I don't. Well, maybe even if I did, you should check it. Okay, I guess it didn't hurt to check. Nope, not that one. Or that one. Nope, not that one. That one's 1997. No, 1985. 2004. Nope. Nope. Not that one. Or that one. Wait, hold on. No, no, no. Not that one. Nope. Nope. <coughs> not that one either. Nope. Nope. Not that one. God damn, that's a lot of so freaking that. pennies, bro. Oh. Well, that one's a quarter. Can I go now? No, because I want to press charges. You really want this to go to court? Yes, I want to judge it. Over a oh, damn okay, penny on, that's uh, literally steel? So dumb. Stupid. I am the Honorable Judge Boober, and today we will be hearing the case of Cody, who says that his friend Junior... He is not my friend! Mm, yes, thank you for clarifying. Let the record show that Junior is not Cody's friend. Okay, Cody... I am his friend. His not friend Junior sold his 1943 steel penny. Cody, tell us what happened. Well, Your Honor, I was showing my coin collection to someone I thought was my friend. But it turns out he was just a coin thief pretending to be my friend. I showed him one of my many steel pennies and placed it right there on the couch. I'm talking right bro, beside he's, like, Bro, really Cody's taking this friend. way too serious, bro. And it's just a bad steel penny, penny bro. Junior took it because he knew it was valuable and priceless to me. Mmm, I see. This is a very serious accusation. Junior, did you really steal his penny? No, I wouldn't steal his dumb, stupid steel penny. I did not care about it. He was showing me his dumb coin collection, and I really did not care at all. And then he put it on the couch, and I don't know what happened to it. It just went missing, and he wants to blame me for it. I know you took my goddamn penny, you big jerk! You, you big old jerk face, the biggest jerk face I've ever seen! Oh, no, 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 no. I will not have any name-calling or foul language in my courtroom. Cody, you have not shown me any evidence that would prove Junior guilty, so I have no choice but to find Junior not guilty. Yes! What? Are you kidding me? Justice has not been served today, Your Honor. Oh, of course! Shut the hell up! 
this is a penny, bro. Get over it, bro. You have so many pennies in your freaking penny box. The judge wasn't there, and I don't even think he was a real judge, so I want to see his credentials. You guys, this Bro, he is a real judge. What do you mean, bro? What type of question is that, Cody? He's What do you mean he's not even a real judge, bro? Of course he's a real judge, bro. He's been a judge since years. This whole thing is just so stupid. Can we let it go? No, Penelope. It was a steel penny. They don't make them like that anymore. Guys, what is this? That's a lint roller, idiot. Look what's on the lint roller, idiot. Probably lint. Get your good glasses on, Cody. Look. Uh, let me see that. What? My penny! <laughs> oh, when I was rolling up the fur, I must have actually rolled up your penny. Wow, I guess I can take these mad eyes off. I don't need these anymore. Well, don't I just feel silly? Yeah, it's and a big stupid. Misunderstanding. Yeah, aren't I just the silliest? Bro, just the bro literally did all of this. Bro literally made me go to freaking court and freaking said so many trash things about me. All because of. All because he was mad over. And, bro, he was saying a lot of garbage things to me. He literally m sent me to the courthouse. All because of this stupid goddamn penny. It's a big old accident. Yeah, yeah, it's okay, Junior. That happens to everybody. Yeah, I mean, it just, it, it, things happen, you know? <laughs> well, that's just so silly. But you know what isn't silly? Opera GX. All right. Anyways, that's one question. Have you ever lost something? Yes, I've lost a lot of things. I lost a lot of things. I can't even name them. I lost so many things that I don't even remember what I even lost. And I lost so many things that I literally can't literally name all of them. <coughs> but anyways, guys, you guys know what to do. And yeah, guys, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Peace, East, East. And also, guys, subscribe. Please subscribe to the channel. Because we are still at 11,000. Can we make it to 12,000 at least? Like, at the end of this damn uh, month? Please? Well, anyways, guys, you guys got it. You guys already know. You guys got it. All right. Peace!